Lamar Bearden is an American artist born in Charlotte, North Carolina in 1911. He was a very influential artist for generations to come. Three Folk Musicians Painted in 1967, Three Folk Musicians is an abstract painting depicting three men with two guitars and one banjo. Bearden creates textures in the, in the people using bold line strokes across all of their clothing. Also painted in 1967 is Melon Season. It shows two African American women sitting in a tan background which is just a large amount of negative space. This work is interesting because it is abstract but also has few parts of very realistic work, like the melon itself and the bucket of full seeds. Jazz 2 Jazz 2 was painted in 1980. It has a unique structure to the picture itself. It reminds me of a puzzle because of how all the pink bordered pieces all work together and make one large picture. It depicts a jazz band of African American descent. The work was made by screen print. Homage to Mary Lou, The Piano Lesson. Painted in 1983, The Piano Lesson is one of Bearden's more realistic works. He uses a bold color scheme to show the surrounding positive space. There are many small and intricate details in this painting. Conversation. Conversation was painted in 1979. It shows two African American women standing in a green field with some sort of factory in the background. He uses a more realistic painting style here. The bottom half of the painting looks like a natural piece of land while the top half looks uh, more futuristic and industrialized. Assembling America Assembling America, painted in 1964, is a very unique painting of, of, of burdens. Sorry. He uses real pictures of people and places put together like a puzzle to create an illusion of a street or alleyway in a crowded town. This is most likely representing an African American community of the time. He uses no real paint, but pictures of people and people uh, and people's stories as his medium. Battle with Cyclones. Battle with Cyclones was painted in 1977. It's very simple, but shows a complex story. It shows uh, native people defending their land against invaders. The red is representing the bloodshed that was the battle. You can see how people bent over in pain. And I feel like that really sets the tone of the painting. McClenburg Evening. McClenburg Evening was painted in 1981 and is an homage to Burden's childhood. This is where he grew up. It is a painting of what he remembered from his childhood home. He uses his iconic abstract painting style and uses multiple items to give the painting a real 3D environment. Golgotha. Golgotha was one of Burden's earliest works. It was painted in 1945. It shows Jesus Christ on the cross. The people in red are the ones who despise Jesus while the ones in blue are the most likely his disciples. The medium for his, this work was watercolors. He's only used watercolors a very small amount of times. Thank you for listening to my presentation.